Your 11 o'clock's here, sir. Okay, send her in. Hey, man. How have you been? Not bad. A little busy. Oh, I'd say. It's been like trying to book a meeting with the Pope. How's Mum? Yeah. As proud of you as ever. Well, she always did have good taste. So, how have you been? You already asked that. The answer was busy. I know I'd already asked it, but I was giving you the chance to ask back. How have you been? And what's so important that you needed to book in a meeting? There's only so many hours in the day, I can't afford to waste them. Mary and I are getting married. Congratulations. We've been um, hand delivering these. Um, I know you're really busy, but I didn't want to make you an exception. I'll have Susan check my diary and if I'm free, I'll come. Mark, it's a year away. You can't have meetings booked that far in advance. I have commitments, Rebecca. A job, responsibilities. You wouldn't understand. Whatever, it's fine, forget it. You know, I really thought that coming here today would be a good thing. I thought it would be like old times and we'd be able to catch up. You know, there's so much I want to tell I you. I said I'd come if I could, didn't I? Listen, I know you don't like Mary. She's fine. I don't have any feelings about Mary whatsoever. You do you. Well, Dad said he'd come. So? So, he's a busier man than you, and yet he is. That is a matter of opinion. I like to think I'm working harder than he ever did. And besides, one social occasion doesn't make up for a childhood of neglect. People change. No, they don't. Yeah, they do. You never used to be such an asshole. Oh, for fuck's sake. What makes you think you have a right to my time? I leave you alone to go live the life you want to live. I leave Dad alone so he can go work into the wee hours of the morning. I don't steal a single minute of your time. You come in here telling me I have to spend time with you if you ask for it. Why, because I owe you something? Because family matters? It's bullshit. All of it. And you know it. I don't waste your time, why are you wasting mine? Right, yeah, because it's all one big fucking equation for you, isn't it? You know, who decided that life was only worth as much as your fucking bank balance? There's so much more to life than this. No, there, there is. isn't! Yes, there is. Yes, there is, Mark. There is nothing to life. Life is what you choose to make it, I choose this. I choose to build something for myself. You choose family. It's fine. Would it be immoral of me to not give all my money to the Red Cross? What? Of course not. I can do what I want with it. But if the Red Cross were to steal my money, that would be immoral. Time is money. And you're robbing me. Is everything okay in here, sir? Heard raised voices. Do you want me to call security? No, that's okay, Susan. My sister was just leaving. You know, your life's not going to fall apart if you take one day off. I know.
Well, that sounded pretty heavy. Anything I can do, sir? Yes. Actually, could you clear my schedule on the 17th of July? There's somewhere I need to be. Of course. Will that be all? Well, that's all. Thank you. <laughs>